So it's 14. Somewhere, somewhere here. Somewhere That's 18, so it's got to be this one, 14. Yep, this is it right here, 14. How about that space right there? So this is the home that Elvis lived in. 14. Ghost Throb. Ghost Throb. And this is what it looks like. And they've left the he would park right out here on the street, his little BMW. I'll show you some photographs of that. And he stayed right here. And he would go behind the house and work and play. I mean, they would play football and all that kind of stuff. And there's kind of, it goes down under there So this is what it looks like if you look across the street right here. Uh, I'm going to turn in a moment. There's a hedgerow right there, there in that photograph, and no sidewalk. Now there's a sidewalk, but there's no hedgerow to prevent you from seeing the creek. This is it. They stayed right here. And this is what it looks like in the neighborhood. So let's do some pick comparisons. Stay tuned. So if you look at this photograph, you can see the edge of that house. You see the window, and then you can see the overhang right there, and the car was parked somewhere right there. So you can see these windows, you can see that overhang, and you see that window. So the car was parked right in here, somewhere in that neighborhood. So I want you to look at the house right there, which is to the left of 14. That is the house right there behind Grandma and Priscilla, Minnie Mae. There it is again. So here is Elvis putting Priscilla in a car on that street right there, getting ready to drive off. And the street clearly used to be two ways, not just one way like it is now. And one more little tidbit, this is the house where Priscilla and Elvis met the first time, 14 Gostras. So in this photograph right here, you can see the window and you can see that post right there and that window right there and the door, you can see the door. So it was taken kind of from this angle right here. And you can see from this photograph, there used to be two posts and a walkway right here. So there was this post and there was a post right here that is now gone and they widened it and put a gate. So there used to be two of those and a walkthrough gate and then a gate here to put a car in. But of course cars were a little smaller at that time. But that is the house right there, friends. Bigger than daytime. All right, so we're gonna walk around to the other side, friends, and look in the back. Stay tuned. I think it's so we're on Guthstrab. You can see the church over there. Of course, the the trees were not this high back then, but the house is down here, and. I think the road was wider at the time. The sidewalk was not quite so wide. And of course you can see people park up kind of on the sidewalk. And it may have been similar to this back then. 
but it's hard to study the photographs on my phone as small as they are with the sunlight. So it is right down here. So you can clearly see what this little neighborhood looked like. And Vernon, I believe, chose this house. And they had the whole house. And the lady that ran the house stayed in an apartment on the very top floor. So right there. And it's interesting, they have those metal blinds too that pull down. It looks, you can see they have the, or maybe it's wood. They have the blinds that pull down over the, the windows. Very interesting. Definitely beyond the shadow of a doubt, the house. And this is movie director Hal Wallace meeting with Elvis discussing the upcoming movie G.I. Blues. So while I was here, I wanted to fly the glory over the house so you can get some perspective where the house is as opposed to other things. So we're going to go up and I'm going to do my 360 move where I kind of look around. Let's just look out in the distance and see what we can see. That is the top of the house. I'm going to move forward. What I was looking for was it's so many photos show that the uh, there's photographs and they say that they're done behind the house. Well, all these houses are behind the house. It wasn't until I went back to uh, Bad Nailham the second time that I figured out where these things happened at. And I went back and actually filmed again, which will be in a later episode. It will not be in this group of episodes. But I actually rented a car and went back one more time, this time by myself, so I could investigate a little harder. And I was able to figure out where all those things are as opposed to this house right here. And I found it to be very, very interesting. So I hope when those come out, you will watch those as well. The Gloria is back on the ground. Yes, indeed. All right, so if Elvis left here, heading to work, this is what it would look like. Of course, the trees were not this large at that time. Everybody rides bicycles here. It's actually over here. They are? Okay, what is this street? Yeah. Uh, no, I, I will take this. This is Schlerstrasse. <laughs> this evidently was a field back then mm -hmm. behind the house. And of course, you can clearly see that the um, Houses have been built 60 years ago. You're going so back to your right. Not, not far away. Okay, good. This is Jolanstrasse. And his house is right down here on Ghoststrasse. The house is right there.